what happened? What caused the scene to happen? It was just insane. Brian Riley still can't believe what he saw last night. His neighborhood mail truck exploding into a flaming heap and then stunned neighbors on North Marston Avenue watched helplessly as the fully engulfed government vehicle rolled backwards down the street. Miraculously, the mail truck came to a stop on a neighbor's lawn before hitting another car or house. This guy's extremely lucky that nobody got hurt, including himself. Fire crews were on the scene in minutes, extinguishing a heap of burning metal, plastic, and whatever mail and packages were still inside. A full day later now, the aftermath is pretty clear from what happened. As you saw in the video, the mail truck rolled from about three driveways down, finally coming to a rest in the front yard of this home, ironically, right in front of a fire hydrant. Here's the view today from inside the house where the truck ended up. Before the blast, Riley's Nest camera captured the mail truck spinning its wheels for 10 to 15 minutes in a seemingly futile climb up the icy hill. He was just pushing it beyond insanity and you could just tell the way he was going that he was just getting more and more mad the whole time. Riley believes a blown tire sparked the explosion. A spokesperson for the Postal Service says the fire's under investigation and the driver's okay. Riley and his neighbors say they've registered complaints in the past with this mail carrier. I don't think this surprised any of us at all. That's the one and only time I've ever actually seen our mailman get out of the vehicle 